Hey guys, it's Shamsa and welcome back to my little kitchen. Today's recipe is masala fries in an air fryer. Quick and easy, ready in under 30 minutes. So leaving you with this one till next time. Happy cooking. And now we're going to run through the ingredients with you quickly and then we'll start cooking. So the ingredients you're going to need is potatoes. I've got one kg of Maris Piper potatoes, which I'm using today. Now Maris Pipers are really good. They're, um, they're an all rounder. They're they're soft and fluffy from the inside when cooked and with the fries they're going to be perfect because they're going to be crunchy on the outside and we want it to be soft and fluffy on the inside. Now if you don't have these you can also use King Edward potatoes. They're also really good for fries and chips and I've peeled them and I've chopped them into fries like that and they're approximately uh, half an inch thick. Now just bear in mind that if you do um, cut them uh, slightly thicker then they'll just take a little longer to cook but they're soaking in cold water at the moment and I've got here two tablespoons of uh, corn flour which I sifted now this is what's going to give that crispy crunchy exterior if you don't have the corn flour you can use rice flour as well that's that'll work perfectly fine I've got here one and a half tablespoons of oil I'm using an olive oil blend you can use any neutral oil that you wish and to season the fries I've got some spices here I've got one teaspoon of salt ground black pepper and cumin seeds. I've got here half a teaspoon of garlic granules and smoked paprika and I've got half a teaspoon of regular chili powder which is going to add a really nice kick to the fries. Um, if you want them less spicy then leave the, the chili powder out. If you want it more spicier go ahead and add more chili powder or you can also add dried chili flakes. You also need a clean tea towel so let's start cooking. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pat dry our fries and I've drained off the water and I've got my tea towel laid out here. So just pop your chips on and then just make sure they're all nicely dry and just wipe the inside of the bowl as well so it's not wet and then just transfer them back into the bowl again. And it should be nice and dry. And the first thing we're going to add is our sifted corn flour. So just add that in half at first, like that. And then pick your bowl up and just shake the chips around. And then go back in again and just add more in like that. Move them around so they're nicely coated, which they are. And now I'm going to add the oil. Just drizzle that over. And again, just give it a shake. And into the bowl that had the corn flour, I'm just going to add all these ingredients in like that. Just give everything a mix. And then just sprinkle that on like that. Again, pick it up, give it a mix, add more of the seasoning until we use it all up. There we are. Right, just set these aside and I'm now going to bring my air fryer and we're going to preheat that. And now we're going to preheat the air fryer at 190 degrees C. So we'll come back once it's ready. Okay, so the air fryer has preheated and it's ready. And I'm gonna take my fries and just add them all in like that. Right, so all those fries fit into my air fryer. I do have a large capacity on this air fryer. If you have a smaller air fryer, just batch cook them. Um, and we're gonna turn it on now and we're gonna cook this at 190 for 20 minutes. So I'm just gonna set the timer. Right, before I start cooking this, I just want to mention 20 minutes of cooking time, but at every five minute intervals, we're going to remove the basket and we're going to shake the fries around. That's going to give even cooking um, to the fries, so they're going to be nice and crispy all over. So at 15 minutes, I'm going to remove the basket. Then again at 10, I'm going to remove the basket. And then again at five, I'm going to remove the basket and then let it cook for the final five minute cook. So I'm going to start it now. And then at 15 minutes, we're going to shake the basket. It's been five minutes that the fries have been cooking away, so it's 
time for the first shake. I'm just going to pause it and I'm going to shake the chips. Now, what you want to do is you want to just toss them. So all the ones from the bottom come to the top like that. And then do that very quickly and then pop them back in again like that. Start it off and then wait for the next five minutes. So 10 minutes in and time to give the fries the second shake. Right, okay, so 15 minutes in and now the final shake. Here it goes. Shake around like that. So the 20 minute timer is up. The fries are ready. Now I'm going to show you how they look. And that is how they look. Now, if you like your fries like this, oh, they're very, very hot, then they're perfectly cooked, ready to eat. I like mine a little crispier. So all I'm going to do is pop them back into the air fryer and cook them for a further five minutes at 190. So total cooking time for my crispier fries is going to be 25 minutes. So I'm just going to do that and I'll show you how they look once they're done. The last five minutes of cooking is over and now to show you guys just look how wonderful these masala fries look. I'm going to plate these up and give you guys a closer look. 